He threw one. <laughs> Did he? Hey, 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 tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me. What's so, it? Tell me about Willie Pep. Okay, the Willie Pep story that I've, I've, I've heard. We've all heard this. The only man in, in, in uh, recorded, well, modern history that never threw a punch and won, and won a round, right? How can you do that, Pete? Me, meaning, meaning, so skillful, slipping, sliding, making the guy miss all the shots. Willie's doing his thing, being Willie Pep, standing on the ropes, whatever, kind of spinning the guy that the referee, that, sorry, the judges thought that was masterful. Willie wins around. You know what I'm saying? Now, I heard the detractor say, I, I, I was watching a special where the detractor said, no, no, that's not true. He threw one punch. I started cracking up. One punch, really, dog? One? One? A whole round. That's when really hundreds missing. Maybe we just pop, touch him one time. Oh, he threw one punch. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I guess he's not that good then. Really? <laughs> <laughs> so who since Pep has repeated that in history? You know what I'm saying? The closest, I think, Pornell Whitaker. Pornell Sweepy Whitaker. You know what I'm saying? Rigondeaux also is very good at slipping. Of course, Lumachenko. You know what I'm saying? So, so we know that um, my thing is always defensive, always slick, always skills. And I, I gosh, grab my guys and my girls to always be slick, hit and don't get hit. When guys walk around and say, I can take a punch. Well, bless you, son. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You're in shape. A punch comes in and you happen to catch a, the, the, the tail end of one. All right, you're still standing. You're good. You're in shape. You'll be all right. But to sit there and take punches, I'm like, I can, I can take a punch. You know what they're going to call you? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Huh? Heel toe. Cause that's how, that's how you be walking. You can tell. You know what I'm saying when they're done with you. You know what I'm saying? Hit and don't get hit. All right, Petey, show, show me some Willie Pep stuff. Hey, uh, can you help me out, Malaya? Step up. Show, what, what, are we, what are we working on tonight to avoid some strikes and then get our strikes in? You don't need gloves. Yeah, well, well, show me well, something. Well, what, show. We're, what we're working on tonight, I had... Um, had Malaya hit me with a, with a, with a, with a two-piece, I jab cross, boom. Give me a two-piece. Boom, boom. And I fire back a, a, a fire back across, and she dipped in here. Now, wham, all over the top, right again. Hit me one, two, bang, bang, I fire back, whoop, it's gone. You know what I'm saying? Now, hit me one, two, three, one, two, three, fire here, whoop, she's gone. You know what I'm saying? So I had to go one, two, she dipped here, she came up with a two, three, and she dipped there. Wow, good, again. One, two. Yeah, she had two, three, and yeah, yeah. So remember where I came out with that right hand? She, she was on me. That makes an easy drill. That makes, that makes that, it real. That's really do, do that drill. Can you do I that? Right, so That'd here. be good for people. She hits me a jab, a jab cross. I fire here. She's gone. Because of a cross hook, I fire here. She's gone. Wherever fire that right hand back at her. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. We went back. Do that bang, again. Bang, I fire. Ah, she's gone. Bam, bam. She's, ah, she's gone. All right. Again, one, two, boop, boop. She drops inside. Boop, boop. Ah, she drops outside again. Bang, bang. She drops here. Bang, bang, she drops here again. Bang, bang, she whoop, and bang, bang, bop, and here, here, she's here, 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 she's there, and here, here, bop, 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 bop. That's the drill, and pop, pop, here, pop, pop, here, and pop, pop, here. You know, PD, I know, I know that uh, a lot of people, we were talking about this, something I've always right. talked about, you're the, you're the master of the, the hands and the feet, but I just want to mention it because I know you'll probably yes, talk sir. about this. Too many people lean back. You yes. know what I'm saying? Yes. Uh, we were just talking we with, should, yeah. well, who's our young boy that was leaning back the other day? Oh, we have, it don't matter, what we about, have to yeah, name him. Kids, yeah. But go ahead. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm talking about? So, so I would do the same jab cross. But when, then, but when they go, they kind of fade. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. jab cross, and she leans this way. And she leans that way. Right? Not, not even fading back, just kind of like to the side a little bit. But yeah. still, still far from me, look, and catch it in that punch. Right. A good box will catch you right there. But hit me a jab cross, and she dips in, she comes to me. I go there. You it's feel me? Only yeah. so many people are so afraid of that. Yeah, yeah. I, because it's, it's counterintuitive, really. Yes. To go towards a punch. They want to run away. You want to run it from it and running away. A good, a good fighter. If I throw, she throws a jab cross, and I'm throwing this, and she dips to the side. Thank you very much. You still gonna get hit. And if you come to me, while well, the fist is going, the fist goes over. Yes. All right, and that's what you gotta remember. You cut it off. You cut it off. You cut it off. It, it comes cut quick. The angle off. Yeah. Right. So that's a good lesson. I'm just trying to yeah. feed more, more information. But you're the I man, PD. What else? Well, what else? Is that all um, we got? Uh, well, let's see what else we had to work on for me this evening. I had to work on for me this evening. Um, Gotta uh, extract a, a, the yeah, technique. A jab cross. A jab cross. Um, I actually had to go jab, jab cross. I had to come all the way through with that right hand. And she did, but turn, jab, chop all the way through. Jab, boom, boom. And she came back to liver. Boom. And from the liver shot, 
From here, she's gonna drop this overhand right, bam, come, come back the other way, right? So she's here, she hit my one, two, hit him, hit him a one, two, right through, the, she comes right through, there's a liver, and she comes, there you go. One, two, turn in, and just drop the short right hand on the top, right? I see that. Two, she's gonna deliver right here, turn up, bitch, over, bam! I, said, I love how you pick up that two. elbow. Nice, right, elbow, get elbow up, fist down, dropping the right hand. One, two, I dig in here, my hand's right here, I turn it over, over, Bam! There goes my shot. Can you talk about the feet a little bit? Because I'm sure some people are gonna. Footwork. So one, two. I'm inside, right? Now from here, look. Okay. My, 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 I'm just, I'm just sit up over my leg, and I drop over the top, right? So again, one, two. Look at my feet. I'm all, all the way now is on the lefty. That comes up to the gut. All right. Up to the liver shot. From here, I'm just gonna turn and sink all the way over again, right? Um, comes up and she just drop it down. Yeah. Again, one, two, up in the gut. Uh uh uh. Right, uh. don't break. So, so don't, don't, you guys go one, two in here, then turn them over again. Now, one, two in here. Wop, wop. Right, guys, yes. right. so one, It's a two. combo. I'm up here, man. Beautiful. Elbow up in the one, two. Here, elbow up. There you go. So elbow goes over my shoulder. This is the most part of the dropping my temple. You feel me? Temple inside of my jaw, all right? There you go. So she goes one, two, then blow. She's up in the guts and drop the thing over. Good. Up and then turn it over. Right? And yow, and yeah, you go. So one, two, on the chin, liver, drop that thing. There's your shot. That's beautiful, Thank Petey. You, all right, last thing I gotta say. How, uh, how are you gonna win a round, though, without throwing the combos like Willie Pep? I can't tell you something. Nobody throws them like Willie Pep. <laughs> He, get, right. he gets one in uh -huh. and he wins a round. Okay. Is this, is this, no, no, no. Here's is this the deal, on though. video? No, no. I, got, I got to see I get, this. Get, I think, I tell you what, I've, I don't know if I've seen that round per se, but I saw a round with his, with his ass slipping and sliding on the rope. I thought the first time I saw that was Hector Lopez, best of soul. Hector El Torero Lopez, um, uh, my, my great boxing friend, my brother, passed on, but. Um, put his butt in the rope and slip and slide. I saw Rory <laughs> Jones doing the same thing also. So I know they got that from Willie Pip. But um, I, I, I hear tell that there was a, an ancient fighter back in Greece who won fights, had several hundred fights, and won the fights without even throwing a punch. He would make the opponent so tired and so, you know what I'm saying, frustrated that they just ancient give up. Ancient Greece? You're ancient talking about Greece, like thousands Olympics. of years ago? I'm talking ago. thousands of years ago. Oh my I God. gotta tell you something, when I heard the story, the first thing, oh, oh, those old bastards didn't know what they're doing. But wait a minute, wait a minute. If we didn't have a Roy Jones, we didn't have a Whitaker, we didn't have a Mayweather, we didn't have a Lomachenko, I wouldn't, you know, I wouldn't believe that. But the truth is, wait a minute, that's possible. I yes. we see Willie Pep, the granddad of them all. Well, for him and his, his old ancient Greek, you know what I'm saying? Who could sip and slide, Ali in his day, sip and slide, Sugar Ray Leonard in his day, sipping and sliding. So, um... I don't know. I don't know what to tell you guys. It's you know, a, it's possible. It's a, you know what? It's okay. a beautiful thing. Yeah. And you know what comes to mind? Yeah. There was probably a Willie Pep before there was a Willie Pep too. Aye, and we just don't know. Well, that's that's what I'm that's that's telling what I'm you. So, so when when they not just ancient Greece, but even in between. In between time, the years, I hate you. I hate you. There, was, there were a lot of great there boxers. There's probably great guys that we never hear, we never saw or heard from. I mean, the guys who came through gyms. I remember coming up, and they never did anything because maybe they didn't have any. Um, I don't know any ambition to to become a, a great fighter, or whatever else. But they were sparring partners. I've, I've, I've seen some guys so amazing. You know what I'm saying? It's Maybe like, they wow. didn't have sugar in their feet like you. Well, I don't know. They had lots of sugar because you're putting hands on me. But um, <laughs> <laughs> that, that, the, before the sugar got sweet, the sugar got to take some lumps. All right? One, hey, one or two. I Anyways. love it. You're still humble. No, you got to be. You got to be. Yeah. You got to be, bro. You know, too many. I've seen too many great, great fighters. And, and all these guys that I've sparred with and worked with and, and, and guys that I admire and watch coming up. And, and, and took a piece of this and a piece of that. All these guys went into to creating the sugar foot. You know what I mean? So yeah. all those fancy moves, they came at a cost, but not getting too lumped up, a cost, no, but hard look, work, really. You still look pretty, Petey. Uh, you know, a little right. bit, a little bit. You know, I still, you know. All right, tell, Anyways. Everybody, tell everybody goodbye. Okay, guys, have a good day. All right. Talk to you later. Thank you, guys. All right. That was a little teach me grappling with, with Coach Pete Sugarfoot Cunningham. You guys know the deal. It's not always grappling here. We're doing a little MMA. We got some kickboxing. One of the best kickboxers in all of history, our buddy, Pete Sugarfoot Cunningham. Hope you guys enjoyed. We'll be back for more next time with more great stuff. Yes, sir.